Hello there, Internet. I'm Olga K. If you're new to this channel, welcome to my living room. This is a casual vlog, and you might be thinking I'm pretending to be Waldo right now. But really, I am pretending to be an American. Here we go. Like this. <laughs> Like this, still wanna look pretty, but now I just look like a pirate. I, as of recently, became an American. What? Everyone's like, what, what does that mean? What does that really mean? Um, I came to this country when I was 16 years old. I didn't speak English. I know it's shocking because right now I just wanna shut up. But no English. I came here with the circus. That's why the whole juggling thing plays into the whole videos. If you're new to my channel and I've lived here for 16 years and I've had a green card so pretty much I was considered to be an American but not exactly and last week I became an American and I thought I'll make a video about this because I realized that not all of you follow me on Snapchat which is real Olga Can Snapchat follow me lots of cool stuff happens there it's like no editing it just happens and it goes out there for you guys this looks so much like a you know that thing that is not circumcised so I became an American and the reason why it's a, such a big deal and I really wanted to announce it here because um, about four years ago I actually used to vlog all the time and I made a video where I talked about how I studied the test I actually know about America more than Americans know about America I've studied like presidents and dates and different things and I was just so excited and I made a video about it and then and then I just never talked about it ever again and everyone's like what happened and I was like can't talk about it anyways my citizenship got denied four years ago and then I had to spend thousands of dollars uh, hiring lawyers hiring like it was like really like I am the true American look at this outfit and uh, long story short, uh, I had to reapply uh, to be an American and I waited almost four years uh, to be accepted into this country and I'm so glad it happened now and uh, uh, it was unexpected. I literally got a letter in the mail and it says, congratulations, you're becoming an American, American in three days, show up here. And I was like, oh, I'm so glad I'm in town. I wanna show you this clip from um, my ceremony Good morning, Snapchat. Today is a really big day for me. Today, I'm becoming an American. So I pulled out my American shirt, scarf, and American bandana, which I'm not allowed to wear, so I dressed up like this, um, because in the rules, when you become an American, you go to the ceremony, they say you have to respect the rules and how important the ceremony is, so you have to dress nicely. But I'm someone who doesn't follow the rules most of the time, so I'm bringing this so I can wear this um, at the end of the ceremony uh, for my selfie for Instagram. I'm bringing Mooshwalks, which is Roxy, and my favorite Alex and Annie bracelets. Create peace of mind, Al, because it's my spirit animal. Love, Scorpio. I love this. And 2016, because it's the year. You, my friend, also will come with me. Get in there. Hang out. I'm becoming an American today. Roxy, I'm becoming an American today. Are you listening? Right now I'm getting my last cup of coffee as a non-American citizen from my favorite place, H House Coffee. Cappuccinos have less milk than lattes, FYI. Hey guys, I'm becoming an American today. They can speak English. To the heat, and even when I was close to the feet, I rose to my feet. Ooh, my life's like a dun 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 Capitalism! Capitalism! Fuck yeah! Thank you! Wow! What is this? Did we do it? I'm gonna stand here until I see my country. So help me God. It's an honor and a privilege to call you a fellow citizen of the United States of America. This is now officially 
in your country. We are a nation united not by any one culture or ethnicity or ideology, but by the principles of opportunity. to pick up my uh, certificate. I'm so excited. We did it! Now I can dress up in my outfits. I didn't put the shirt on, but I thought I'll just put this on and yay! And I got the freaking bear. $30. I really got the bear because it has the date on it. And today is also a very historic date. February 23rd uh, means a lot in this country. Not only Olga K, the Russian citizen, became a U.S. citizen uh, today, but also U.S. Marines raised the flag on Iwo Jima in Japan in 1945. I originally got denied because I had an agent when I was 17 years old working in the circus. He messed up some paperwork uh, for my visas, and I got faulted. Long story short, he was on the run from the FBI because he did lots of bad things, and since I was under his pile, I was denied four years. Finally, thousands of dollars later, and lots of patience and time, everything got sorted out, and here I am. I have no idea what happened to that agent. I haven't talked to him for at least 14 years or 15, I don't know, and screw you for ruining my life for four years. But today, we celebrate the acceptance stuff, and the bears, that cost $30, capitalism, America. All of a sudden, I'm also reminded that Donald Trump is now my problem. Yay! Cheers to that! Thank you, guys. Great. Now my face is all fucked up. How am I gonna do things for the rest of the day? <sighs> the first thing I got to do as an American <laughs> is to try to replace my tire. I'm gonna show you what's happening. <laughs> oh my god, a flat tire. Oh my god. Put you back to me, Lorene. <laughs> Lorene's never done this before, and I've loosened this one. But I have now, no idea what I'm doing. But now we have to loosen. Get it, girl, like you mean it. Work that tire, girl. Crank that shit. You got it, you got it. I Get it? Look at those muscles. Ooh. Ooh, okay. This one's loose. Woo! Two loose, two to go. We oh. found a man. <laughs> That's cool. We found a man <laughs> on the side of the street. Oh, Hi. Thank you. Oh my god. <sighs> Did you like it? Did you watch it? Did you consume all of it? This is, this looks like it could be my stripper pole, but it's just the lamp. That's how boring I am. It's just the lamp that I'm standing next to. For those of you that don't know the difference between having a green card and having a citizenship, I'll tell you. So there's really not that much difference, but here's why it's important to me. Um, I can vote. And what a great time to be dropped into this country to be able to vote all Trump and Bernie and Hillary. There's like so much history happening and so much like, what the fuck? Uh, fuck is a bad word, don't use it. The other biggest difference is I am a Russian citizen, so I have a Russian passport. So every time I wanted to go to England or France or Italy or any of those countries, uh, I have to apply for visas, which cost a lot of money sometimes, like $200, and they only give you a visa for like three months. And then you have to uh, wait for like a month or two. Um, and if you want to expedite, it's more expensive. So traveling is a lot more difficult for a Russian citizen. So I'm excited to be able to travel now. If YouTube has an event in London, I can just jump on the plane and go. So that's great. But the most important thing that is really awesome is that my mom, I can actually make my mom and my dad and my brother maybe, I can make them a green card and they can come to this country with no problems. Because my mom would always have to fly to a different 
city in Russia and apply for her visa and sometimes she gets denied and sometimes she gets approved and it's like a process that is so grueling on my mom's health because she's older and she's not well and she has to go and do that every time she wants to see me and she's like I'm done doing that and so now we're just like okay now we're gonna get your green card and it's gonna be fine so I'm an American now and that means nothing really when it comes to my Russian citizenship. I actually have dual citizenship and now I will have a blue passport which I haven't applied yet and then I also have one of these and it's a Russian passport for those of you who have never seen a Russian passport. So on another note, I'm making Willa Juggle videos and everyone is like, oh my god, is this channel all about Willa Juggle? Not exactly. I'm making some other stuff as well. It's just taken me a while and I just written an episode with Razorblade and Olga K getting into another fight. So <laughs> thank you guys for being so awesome and checking in and being rooting for me and sending me like artwork when I was becoming an American for those of you that follow me on Snapchat. Bye.